गाइज डू यू वॉन्ट टू रन जाबा प्रोग्राम इन एक्लिप्स आई डी सो दिस वीडियो इज फॉर यू हे गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल गाइज इन दिस वीडियो आई विल बी शोइंग यू हाउ टू इंस्टॉल एक्लिप्स आई डी ऑल्सो आई विल बी शोइंग यू हाउ टू क्रिएट एंड रन जाबा प्रोग्राम यूजिंग इट सो लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो सो गाइज बिफोर इंस्टॉलिंग एक्लिप्स आई डी यू हैव टू फर्स्ट इंस्टॉल जाबा जे डी के आई हैव गिवन वीडियो लिंक इन डिस्क्रिप्शन बॉक्स एज वेल एज यू कैन क्लिक ऑन आई बटन to watch that video so guys i hope the installation of jdk is done now we will be proceeding for installation of eclipse id guys you can open any of your favorite browser and just search for eclipse download and here guys you can see the official website that is eclipse.org you need to just click on this eclipse download link so guys it will redirect you to download page and here you can see we have button download we will just click on this button Again, it will redirect you to this page. Now, again, you need to click on download button. And guys, at the top, you can see the download has been started. It will take a while. And guys, you can see the download is done. Now, to start the installation, I will be clicking on this exe. Let me minimize my browser, guys. And here, you can see my Eclipse installer has been started. And guys, here you can see it's showing various option. We have Eclipse ID for Java. We have Eclipse ID for Enterprise Java. Also, we have for C, C++, PHP, and so on. You can scroll and see. You can install it for whatever you want. But in this video, I'm showing. you eclipse id for java hence i am selecting first option so let me just select this first option so guys it has taken me to this page and here it's showing me java jdk hence i told you to install jdk first if you are not installing jdk at the beginning you can select sites from here also this also takes a time uh, for installing hence i prefer installation of jdk first not from here so now guys um, it has already detected my jdk and here we have the installation folder so in this folder my eclipse will be install if you want to change you can click on this folder button and you can change here we have two option create start menu entry and create desktop shortcut so if you want both check mark it otherwise you can uncheck i am keeping the default one and i am clicking on install button and guys here it is showing me license and agreement page so i am just going to select accept now so guys now you can see my installation has been started it will take a while Okay guys so you can see my installation is done here it's showing me installation completed successfully and here it's showing me launch button also you can see the shortcut has been created on desktop so to launch my id i will simply click on this launch button and here guys you can see it's showing me directory as a workspace so here uh, this is the default directory where your project will be save everything will be save if you wish to change you can click on browse button i'm keeping the default one and i'm clicking on this launch button guys so guys my eclipse id has been started let me just cross this welcome page now i'm going to show you how to create java project and how to run it so guys let's go to file menu and here we will be taking new option and then java project so now here guys we have to provide various details for our project so first of all we will be providing name to the project so i'm just giving hello demo as name to my project and here we have check mark de use default location so whatever workspace directory you have selected that is going to be a default location for your project if you want to change you can uncheck this use a default location and you can click on browse button and select the directory wherever you want to save the file so i am keeping the default one and now under jre guys i will be selecting this second option so here you can see it's showing me my jdk and now here guys i'm just unchecking this create module info and then guys i'm clicking on this next button and here guys you can see it's showing me my um, build setting so uh, hello demo src and here you can see it's showing me output folder you don't need to do anything over here just click on finish button and guys you can see the project has been created at left side this is the project hierarchy we have the jre and uh, inside that folder hello demo we have src 
and that is blank guys so we will be uh, creating java classes inside this src so to create java class just select this src and right click it and guys select new option over here and under new option you have to select class okay now here provide the class name whatever you want so i'm giving name as hello world and in package i'm giving cs corner you can skip package name if you want i've just provided package name and my modifier is public i'm creating public class guys under the method i'm going to check mark the first option that is generate public static void main so it my this class is going to be my main class so if you don't want you can uncheck and just click on finish button and guys you can see my hello world dot java file has been generated here you can see the first line it's showing me as package name then we have a class name and under that we have a public static void main method okay so let me delete this comment and here i'm going to type a simple statement so for that i'm just writing sys out and i'm pressing control space so guys you can see it has generated a line system dot out dot print ln so this is the line which we use in java for printing any statement on console so in this i will be simply typing thanks for watching so my code is done guys now i'm going to save this code so you can click on save button or save all or control s and now let's run this project so to run this project you need to just click on this play button and boom guys you can see it's showing me my output on my console that is thanks for watching so guys this way you can install eclipse id and you can create and run your java program using it so i hope guys by following my video you are also able to run your java program successfully so guys if my video has really helped you don't forget to hit on like button and if you have any query you can put in comment box i will surely reply to your queries and guys if you find my video useful you can share my videos to your friends also and guys if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit bell icon also guys i'm sharing lots of pdf and notes on my uh, telegram channel you can join my telegram channel i'm sharing reels on my instagram all my social media link i have given in description box you can follow or join me thank you guys for watching my video i'll see you in my next video till that Bye-bye, take care, keep learning and keep watching guys.